Hello, everyone. So I got another package from my vampire friend. Thank you very much, the person who sent this. And I know one of the things in it, but I don't know all of what's in it. So let's go ahead and take a look. I kind of already opened it, just so I wouldn't have to be cutting it open on camera. So here we go. Oh, man. She was right. This is, oh, goodness. Yep, I'm adding hot water to that. This is a potion. I'm not going to tell you exactly what's in it, but this is a potion that is go is very remarkable, especially if it's like her other potions. She grows her own herbs, and she presses them and processes them and sends me potions. It looks like it's going to hurt me, but it won't hurt me. <laughs> her potions are actually pretty good quality, even if they're not pretty. But, ah, this is going to be awesome. So, let's see what else we got in here. That's the main thing. Growing the hallucinogens. Well, that hits it on the nose, doesn't it? <laughs> as far as what the... All right, yeah, actually, I, I haven't seen this book before. I think she might have sent me a picture of it. But here, it's called, this is what it's called. That's the author. And then I'll just get a quick shot of what's on the back. That's what the book is all about. I'm really interested in this book because, just to let you know, I love mushrooms. I love hallucinogens. Don't like acid. Anything with THC as well as will just mess my schizophrenic brain up. So the next thing is an open coffin with, what is this? Huh, is this a pipe? What, what is this? A stick of some kind. Uh, read the note. All right. Make sure I can read this. May 2021. Dear little brother, I haven't forgotten you. Have some new something for you. It is, uh, if it's thickened in transit, just add warm water and shake well. It contains actual plant material, so save it. You can add more water and thin it again if you want to. And then what's the rest say? She also writes very clearly because I'm really bad about reading handwriting and like really bad at it. Uh, it's page two. Sh uh, shake it up hard before every drink. Plant material tends to settle on the bottom. Dosage question mark. One shot glass every four hours to kill pain. Yours, Sherry. Thank you very much, Sherry. That describes the potion. Let's see if we can figure out what this is by context clues. What else do we have in here? We got a bunch of sticks. Uh, I think that these sticks, she might have made some kind of an uh, ignition source and put it on these sticks. I'm not sure. It just feels like a bunch of sticks, though, to be honest. <clears throat> I'm willing to bet there's some kind of fire stick, unless something that was made of sticks broke in here. But I'll definitely have to ask her. Uh, here's a little coffin. I'm digging it. I'm digging it. I love this. I'm going to use that for something. Might even leave it as an offering at a gravestone. Let's put this aside. Ah, man, I'm gonna have, I have a stack of books. So let me explain something to y'all. So, all right, one, two, uh, I think that's all of them. So I keep on sending her vampire books and she keeps on writing pages and pages of notes talking about if they're accurate or things that she learned from it because she herself is a vampire, uh, but she does not feed. Um, she takes, she makes her own potions instead that uh, keep her from feeding. So this is one of the books. She's got a bunch of notes in that. This is another book that I sent her. Bunch of notes in that. This is another book that I sent her, Dr. Sleep. Bunch of notes in that. I mean, look at all of That's a lot of notes. And then this one. And there's a... <laughs> almost out of paper. <laughs> but yeah, there's... So all of these have a number... I've only read a little bit, and all of them have uh, so many pages of notes. And I'm looking forward to actually reading them and perhaps sharing some of these with you and uh, seeing if uh, the information intrigues any of you out there. And I might make more videos based on if you all like those. But that's in the future. So, oh, what the heck is this? It feels like wax, but also other material. What is what is in that? All right, well, there's a note attached to us. Let's take a look. Fire flakes. Heavily scented, burns very hot. Won't change color, but smells sweet and makes a fire start really fast. Well, I'm guessing that's what these sticks are for too, because these with the sticks, I'm guessing will start a really good fire. Excellent, thank you very much, Sherry. Let's see if, uh, oh, and the final thing is, well, there's fire flakes everywhere in here. Uh, the final thing is she got some really shiny penny, pennies for St. Expedite, because she knows a St. Expedite. I work for St. Expedite and he loves shiny pennies. So she sends me all kinds of shiny pennies. At any rate, that is, uh, that is everything, everybody. Thank you very much, Sherry. Um, let me know what you all think in the comment section below if you all be interested in those books or you want to know more about any of this. And uh, you can message me at www.facebook.com slash 
hunter.salazar, H-U-N-T-E-R, period, S-A-L-A-Z-A-R. If you have any personal questions about any of this, uh, if it's something that's not personal, you just want to say, you know, this is really interesting, feel free to shoot down in the comment section below on YouTube. At any rate, thank you, Sherry. Thank you all for watching, all of you. Have a wonderful day.